Hello friends, how are you? You can see that there is a 2D diagram of a water bottle and now I'm going to show you how to draw this water bottle in AutoCAD. So let's begin. Okay, so at first select line. and take the length in millimeter enter so you can take 10 millimeter or 10 centimeter whatever you want okay and now take the length 4.5 enter okay enter again now take the length 4.5 enter enter again okay now select start in radius arc and just one click here and another click here yes and basically take the radius uh 20 enter okay now select fillet now click on radius and put the radius just one enter enter again and select this two okay now again select fillet now select radius and select the radius point three enter and enter again select these two lines okay now select line now take the length one, enter again. So the length one. Okay. <coughs> now again select line and select another line, take the length point five, enter. Select circle and draw diagram, draw circle and see the radius 0.5 enter. Okay, now just let this let this one. Now select line and from this midpoint draw line. Length will be 10 millimeter. 10. Okay. Now Select circle and draw a circle. Okay. Now delete this one. Now select oh, sorry. Select this region and select frame. Yes, trim this part. And yes, also this parts. Enter okay now select this one click on mirror and okay mirror now select this portion and click on frame and in this part okay Okay, now again select line and from this midpoint draw line and then it will be 24.5 enter. Okay. <coughs> okay, now select line, it will be 10 enter again and also it will be 10 okay <coughs> sorry for the one and select circle and okay or this one actually 
So the line and take the length. Suppose take the length twelve. Okay. And select this arc and draw an arc and take the radius 12 enter okay now delete this one now select okay now select fillet now select radius select 8 enter select this portion and okay it is uh, very much high actually control Z okay uh, again select fillet radius 1 enter okay not a good choice Okay, again fillet radius suppose 50 enter okay it's very high okay so we need an, we need an appropriate radius actually so what can we do then we can apply more actually fillet radius sub 20 inter okay bad idea actually so go back okay so we can again draw this one select like this one arc okay now take the radius suppose Ten, enter. Okay. Now we can delete this one. We can select this portion and select frame and frame this parts. Enter. Okay. And we can also trim this part. Enter. Okay. Now select this portion. Select fillet select radius take five enter select this two okay five is more okay again okay fillet two radius select one enter okay you can minimize actually this one Select radius and five enter. I think select here. Yeah. Again, fillet radius and one enter. Okay, to Z, fillet, radius, point two, enter. Bad idea actually. Fillet, radius, point one, enter. Okay, so point one is good, I think. So we can uh, delete this portion. So you can select this one, select the mirror command and enter. Okay. Now, so it will be a little bit different from the previous one. Okay. Now we can select line. 
just if you just uh, change the dimension and then it will be changed also so it will be a little bit different from the previous one so select line two okay and it will be 20 enter and join this to enter okay now okay one portion is left from this side that is select line 0.5 select line and 5 okay so that portion is complete we need to fill at this part so fill it radius 3 enter okay again fill it radius 3 oh four actually enter okay now again fill it radius this will be one enter enter again okay now select arc <laughs> wrong selection okay so we need to make the arc and the radius can be Twenty. Enter. Okay. So we can delete the previous one. We don't need this one actually, or you can move this one from another portion. Okay, skip here. Okay. Now we need to put the dimension line. Now. Okay. Ah, uh, sorry. Dotted line center line now yes the center line okay now we should put the dimension actually now length okay and also length from this point to this point okay so just the line okay length okay oh open one can be no problem again length from top point to bottom point okay so if you change the dimension everything will be changed and so length okay now radius enter so we need to put the radius enter put the radius enter enter okay now also enter we need this radius also 20 and another length okay so drawing is complete hope you enjoyed the video don't forget to subscribe if you have any, and if you have any question just ask in the comment box like and share with your friends
थैंक यू